Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. So I initially was going with garage products, um, bushings. Uh, blah 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 it was more effort than it was starting to be worth and the money was I don't know if I knew how good they were maybe I'd I'd feel better about getting I don't know but anyway so I'm ending up I went uh, ended up going with ATV the heck were they called superatv.com I believe um, I think I think <laughs> These are all the bushings I need. Um, you can see this is the rear. And there are yeah, two of those. So, both exactly the same. So, of course, that's side for side. I feel like I'm not getting like any I don't know I don't know what to expect if it's for the shocks too or what but digging into it shortly so we'll see we'll see yeah we'll see how far it goes what bushings those actually are <laughs> Yeah, a little update. Actually, this is going smoother than I thought. And rarely, <laughs> is that said, but how I did it, <clears throat> pulled, there's the bottom bolt, the longer one. I pulled that out, um, and there's that. I used a mechanic wire of whatever sort you want. It's actually electrician wire. It's like part of a 12-2, I think it was. Uh, roll. Now there's the bottom bushing there. This top one here looks extremely easy. So I'm going to do the bottom, swap those out, unbolted those, pulled those. Um, like I say, tie this up there. Holds the stuff up out of your way so you can move this around. Um, but now you have great access. So you swap out your bushings, get the new ones in there. It's a little grease. Put it back together. I'll pick up when I get to the up top one here. Anyway, not the best shot on it, but one I've seen. Proceed. I'm on to the uppers. Um, granted, I'm taking my time. <laughs> but um, this has gone... Let's focus. No, it's just not... Okay. Um, blah, blah, blah. It's gone rather well. Um, again, taking my time. Had to do this twice because, anyway, the one in there had, how about that? So this one, got it all in, everything back on the complete bottom, found out that was about out. Foolishly enough, I just didn't look close enough and care. <laughs> anyway, put it back in, that's fixed. I left all of them loose grease them. I'm going to do the same for the top. This was very simple, all 15 millimeter. Um, or am I using? Yeah, 15 millimeter. Um, so one bolt up top, one bolt out the bottom. They go in from the back side and go forward. 
you can see the head on that one. There's that side. Um, yeah, I can't see that one. But, oh yeah, this one. Yeah. Anyway, so. That simple. Pull those out, put the new ones in, wipe everything down, fresh grease, reverse what you just saw, put it back in there, throw the bolts in, don't snug them, grease everything. When everything's greased, then maybe even move things up and down. That might be a little more than you want to do because you got to put the tire on or prop this up and then push up and down. Anyway. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it loose, grease it, verify it comes out, then snug it down and call it good. So one side almost completed. I'm having a bit of a, a dilemma here, so this is the right here is the stock um, bushing and whatever you wanna call it that goes in that part that goes on the inside here of you know this where it mounts the frame um, it didn't have any play that I recall and those that's way more coverage than those new ones I know that they're supposed to be a better you know material and everything I'll put the new one in um, just because I'm doing all of the new ones but I am saving that old one along with all my old ones actually and if I need to replace what a, you know, I, I, I'll keep them. Anyway, <clears throat> skeptical. Hopefully it's good, hopefully it's it's fine, but to me, having a lot more material, even if it's a little worse, that's way more coverage than these small things, so. We'll see, fingers crossed. Well, there we are, back together. Everything's greased, pre-greased, after grease, through the fittings, till it came out of both ends while everything's loose then I snugged it down well by hand so I know what's what um, yeah putting this wheel on headed to the other side then to the fronts